Back pain can be a when you're busy burying begonias. But we're proactive versus reactive, right? So rather than just focusing on the pain when it happens, let's do some things to prevent that in the first place. So inherently, doing your landscaping, there's a lot of forward bending, pitching over, so on and so forth. It's a lot of moving in one direction. It's like bending your finger back and keep pulling, 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 and at a certain point, it starts to hurt. There's a couple things we can do to reduce that forward stress from occurring in the first place. One is, especially with the pad for your knees, just work on hands and knees in a quadruped position. By being in this position, we maintain more of a neutral spine. We're not bending so much at the back. We're putting more force in our upper body and lower body. Number two is half kneeling position. By assuming half kneeling, you can adjust yourself appropriately and you can hinge at the hips this way as opposed to rounding at the back this way. Another one is if you have the mobility is to go into a low squat position. Now you're gonna have some rounding the low back here, which is totally fine, but over time this may become bothersome, but it's a nice variation. So overall, use all three. Variability is the key here, moving around, changing positions, doing different things, not doing the same thing over and over again, which leads into an issue. Which leads into how to treat the issue. If you have an issue, if you're starting to feel that back pain tension coming up, if you're spending a lot of time forward, what do we do to balance it out? Bend backward. So simply take a break from doing some of your yard work, stop, take your hands, put them behind your back, and do a trusty back bend. Bend back as far as you can go, breathe out. <sighs> Repeat for five or 10 times, reduce some of that back pain, continue working on your beautiful begonias. Lastly, remember, doing yard work is a lot of load on your body. You're gonna feel some soreness. So it's best to try and break up some of that load throughout the day or through the weekend, or just spread it, instead of doing it all at once, spread it out over a period of time because all that low level force over time, it can build up and it's normal to be sore. However, it's not normal to deal with pain, stiffness, loss of range of motion, loss of strength, loss of function. So let's be proactive by preventing that, by making sure we're changing positions, moving often, and we're offsetting some of that forward stress that we're creating 